reported uh, an investigation going back between 2011 2015 that you were among the targets uh, of a woman who was in effect a Chinese spy right trying to establish contacts with US politicians rising uh, politicians did you have and I should note to people that you cooperated in this investigation and were given a briefing by the FBI did you have any concerns about this person before you had what's known as a defensive briefing from the FBI to make you aware of this threat no Jim, I, I was shocked when, you know, just over six years ago, I was told about this individual. And then I offered to help, uh, and I did help. And I was thanked uh, by the FBI uh, for my help, and that person is no longer in the country. Uh, and I was a little surprised to read about my cooperation in that story because the story says that, you know, there was no, there was never a suspicion of wrongdoing on my part, and all I did was cooperate. And the FBI said that yesterday. But the wrongdoing here, Jim, is that at the same time this story was being leaked out is the time that I was working on impeachment on the House Intelligence and Judiciary Committees. And if this is a country where people who criticize the president are going to have law enforcement information weaponized against them, uh, that's not a country that any of us want to live in. And I, I hope it is investigated as to who leaked this information. These operations are designed to build relationships, but also possibly to get sensitive information. Are you concerned that you shared any information with this person before you were notified by the FBI? Well, I, I know that I didn't. Uh, again, I, I can't talk too much about the details of the case, even though others may have violated their oath. I'm not going to violate mine. But the Axios story made it absolutely clear uh, that no information was ever uh, shared, except, Jim, the people who did share classified information were the people who leaked this story. And to do that uh, against the critic of the president, they may think that they're going to silence me. They're not going to silence me. Uh, but what they are going to do is they're going to make others think twice when they're asked to sit down and provide defensive information uh, about people like this. I hope none of my colleagues ever find themselves in the position that I found myself in, that I found myself in uh, by having to sit down with the FBI because someone who had helped the campaign was trying to do this. But I hope every person would want to help their country just as I did.